how to move an internal MPC project to SD card. Mr. This is Mr. DKTV. This video is brought to you by my sound company. Sounds premium. How to move an internal MPC project to a SD card. I will show you in this video. Stay tuned. I've accidentally saved the project to my internal hard drive of my MPC. I will open up the project right now, chill Afrobeat 2. I've done this project a few days ago. I will load it up. If you're interested how I've produced this rhythm, you can check it out in the right corner of this video. Just click on it and then you can see how I have produced this rhythm. Just let us check the hook. And now I want to move it over to an SD card. I put it in the SD card slot. What I have to do now is first save this project on my SD card. I go to this file folder here and now I'm hitting the option save as and go to my SD card right here and tell him to save the project. Now all the data is being transferred to my SD card and after that I can delete the project on my internal drive. First of all I will make sure that the beat is complete and running, that nothing is missing. So I just give it a try, hook again. Yes and now I can remove the project on my internal drive going to shift menu and then I'm in the browse folder and I will remove it pressing shift and delete file delete now I have only deleted the project file but not the project folder I have to do that also I go to this hide project data folders I will deactivate this one close it and now I can see the data of my shield Afrobeat is here and I will of course delete the data because this is much more bigger than just the project file and I tell him to delete this one also. Chilled Afrobeat 2 delete file and I tell him delete and now the whole file is deleted. I can now check hide project data folders again and close it again and now my project is gone and I only have it on my SD card chilled Afrobeat and load and my beat is back into my MPC but saved on my SD card and why do I have to do that? Well, when I want to transfer data from my MPC to my MPC software for example I have to make sure that the data is saved on an external uh, storage, for example an SD card. I can also use a USB stick or an SSD drive which I've installed in my MPC Live. If you have an MPC one you can't install an SSD drive internally but you can use an SD card for example, that's no problem. So the process is exactly the same, no matter if you are using an MPC Live, MPC Live 2, MPC 1 or MPC X, the process is identically. So this is how you do it and I've told you why to do it. So don't save any projects to your internal hard drive of your MPC. Don't make that mistakes. If you want to transfer anything, it makes things much more complicated. And if you have accidentally uh, saved a project on your internal MPC hard drive, now you know how to remove it. Thanks for watching. I've reached nearly 1000 subscribers. I'm very close. Thanks a lot for your support. So just subscribe. And another thing I want to mention is my upcoming MPC expansion called Just Married 808s and Kicks in Love. It's sounding like this.
If you like these kind of sounds, just subscribe to my newsletter. You will find the link in the video description. If you sign up to my newsletter, you will receive a discount code when my product is out. My new upcoming MPC expansion, Just Married, 808s and Kicks in Love. The cover looks like this. Don't forget to subscribe and see you next time. Sundays, 9 o'clock, Mr. DKTV. I'm out of here. Blessings.